and we are back with the Life is Strange cliffhanger here. We're gonna keep on going and keep on recording this pet menus because we wanna keep we wanna keep the vibe up, we wanna keep the reaction up and we wanna keep um the um suspense up so we can keep the moment going because this thing is going crazy right now. I'm just I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. Max, did you forget we've gone over this? I hope you weren't messing around with time while I was sleeping. Not anymore. I'm just spaced out too. Welcome back to the real world, Max. I don't think I can ever tell Chloe about what happened. Or she didn't know. When here's how. That all? Are we good? Let's look at the big board and see all our pieces in the puzzle so far. So close yet so far away. We have to do three main things. Right. Um, what things? One, decipher Frank's logbook. Two, get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three, beat Step Douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the Darkroom. And I do have a gun now. Keep it in your pants. We'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. <sighs> Fine, whatevs. It's your power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or Blackwell would be in big trouble. At least you let me take that money to pay Frank off. <sighs> Don't remind me. I just want him off your back. Our back. I know. You should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. I'm gonna cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Or to who. Then be careful of step crack. He's not going to be a happy camper after you reamed him yesterday and mom is giving him the boot. I'm on it, partner. I can't abuse... I don't even know. Yes? Get out. You won this battle, Max. You broke up my family. I salute you. David, I didn't try to hurt you. Ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Too late, isn't it? You just better be damn careful with her. Don't you wander off into the dark. Right. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. I promise I'll help Miss Grant next time. If there is one. Oh, meow, Miss Grant. Twist that knife. At least he has one weird fan. Wish I had surveillance footage of that conversation. Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? David must be working for the Prescotts, too. That's interesting. That makes me sad. It was so incredible to see William again. I wish Chloe could too. You kept it? Either Chloe stole another gun, or David is out there armed. 
Oh no. What the hell did David do for Nathan? And what did his dad do for David? I don't think she took another gun. I think she would have been <clears throat> okay with it. Uh... Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey, David, what you hiding? Oh, look at the baby blue jay eggs in the nest. I, I better move this plank if I want to take the shot. Excuse me. Just one picture, please. That's whatever. Just take the picture and put it back. Click. Another photo from my Arcadia Bay wildlife series. Oh, thank you. Sleep tight, my eggy eggs. What consequences is in that? I'm confused. Where's that photo at? I guess not. I thought there was supposed to be like a file where it has like the pictures you've taken. Hey, here we go. Yeah, I doubt it. I, I don't see how that's really a consequence. I don't really want to know. Oh, seven. One, one. No, I think it's seven. I knew that number would be important. First try. Oh, maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh, yes. Wait, hey, what? We're being stopped. Wait, that's the, isn't that the picture of Whoa, I'm being major stopped. Score. Back to Chloe now. I was being super stalked. It's a Yo, Chloe! Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus some location coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance army. Now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. But I absolutely have to go see Kate in the hospital right now. I want to find out how she's doing. Ooh, why are you too happy? Mm. I'll see how some really uh, consequences we put it back. Oh, the photo. This is definitely Kate's floor. The hospitals always freak me out. I, I hear you. But imagine how Kate feels. I'm so glad I, I get to see her again. I hope it's not too weird for her. No, she'll be stoked to see you. Who wouldn't be? This be it. I'm a little nervous. Just go in there and be her friend. I'll wait out here so you can chill by yourselves. I was a total dick for blowing a fuse when you answered Kate's call the other day. Good thing you ignored me. I had no idea what shit she was going through. And you saved her. Like me. I'm sorry. Thanks, Chloe. But don't be sorry. We're all on the same team. Team Max. Let Kate know we're gonna string Nathan up by his balls then. Oh yes, <laughs> I'm on it. Apparently some places don't have consequences, even though the butterfly thing pops up. Hmm. 
Max. Oh, Kate. I thought I'd never see you again. I feel so ridiculous. I'm so sorry. Kate, listen to me. You have nothing to be sorry about. Other people do. You do not know how happy I am to see you. You look awesome. Is it a stupid question if I ask how you're doing? Now that you're here, I'm doing even better. I'm so grateful to you for coming up to the roof to talk me down. Max, I felt so lost and alone. When I saw how much you cared, how hard you were trying, you made me realize I wasn't alone. Thank you. Kate, there are so many people who love you and want to help you. I know. You should see all the letters and postcards. I gave most of the flowers to other patients here because they need them more than me. I'm keeping the balloons, though. One of the nurses <laughs> gave me some pen and paper so I could do some drawings. I love your illustrations. <clears throat> they got kind of dark there for a while. But I have an idea for a new children's book about bullying. I was thinking of having some photographs in there, too. I hope that's a subtle hint that you'll let me take the photographs for the book. Was that subtle? You better take the pictures, Max. Thank you. you I'm no going choice. to be here for another day until my family comes out to visit. How are they treating you? Like they need to protect me forever. They're so upset, and I know they feel guilty like, even though they didn't do anything. Image I was surprised how many students from Blackwell wrote me. Daniel and Mr. Jefferson. Even Victoria wrote me a very sweet note. And I believe she was being real. Me too. I'm glad you believe again, Kate. I'm working on it, Max. I just pray I can get this drawing right. Uh, okay, look, 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 look. Um, I'm sitting again, sure, we're not. Let's recap. It's amazing to just sit here quiet with Kate again. I don't think I'll ever know how much destiny I'm changing. But whoever said we only have a single fate? <sighs> Time travel is such a mindfuck. This is the most creative part, I have to say again. This review, take a big breath, go over your choices. It's the best part of the game. Not the best, best part, but it's one of the best parts of the game. And it's like, you get to see what she's thinking, you get to see the character you're playing so and stuff. Hang out with you again. Max, I owe you so much. And I can tell you want to talk to me about something. Hmm, Nathan. I want you to know I'm this close to getting all the info I need about Nathan. Nathan Prescott has to pay for what he did. Yeah. And we have to stop him from hurting anybody else. Well, I did get his ass suspended, so... That might be a start. You did? Oh, right on, Max. I love how fearless you are. So what is going on with him now? Um, eh. I think his family is totally protecting him. Or worse. I never say this about people, but Max... There's something evil about the Prescotts. No, they no, have no. something to do with death. We're going to stop him. I just have to find Nathan's room number, get inside, and get the clues I need. Max, please let me help. I can get the number, and I'll text it to you, okay? Of course, Kate. I can't do this without you. Now it's time for Nathan to watch out for us. Whoa, 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 whoa. I have to get back to our uh, mission. 
You don't know how much it means to see you again. I do. That's why I love you, Max. Thanks for taking care of my bunny. Tell Alice I'll see her soon. Why are you still going? Stat! That's what you get. I told you to stop. Kate, it is so good. Max. Kate. I always want to talk to you. We missed our tea session this week. That was so not cool. We need to plan like a tea shop tour of Portland. Oh yes. And you could bring Warren along too. Uh. What do you think of uh, Warren? Oh. Smart and silly. He's got such a good heart. And he's a cutie pie. What's a cutie pie? You know he likes you. I'm going to the drive-in with him, so <laughs> we'll see. With everything that's going on, a, a date seems weird. No, you deserve that. Kate Marsh, matchmaker. I'm glad somebody is looking out for my love life. Even angels need angels, Max. I have to get back to. Nope. I, I do. I ain't telling you about Nathan. Cause it got some consequences. Well, how is she? She's still Kate Marsh. Thank God. I'm glad we came to see her. Thanks for coming with me. Now let's go pay a visit to Nathan Prescott. Hey. Right. That little prick is not gonna be glad when he sees us. Yeah, why make her do it? We can do it ourselves. She just came back from suicide. Like, we can do it ourselves. Did they really play football in front of the girls' dorm? Cause I thought that was the girls' dorm right there. Hey, Max. How are you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend, Chloe. Yeah. Chloe? Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for this school. It's a long story. In actual files here. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird just being on campus like everything's normal. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I think there's too much going on in my life. On that note, Blackwell duty calls. Remember, I'm going to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party. So I hope you'll be there to celebrate. Even though I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo. I understand your reasons. You can't force an artist to work. I feel like a total loser, but it's been a hard week to focus. No pun intended. I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend. And I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. And nobody should have to see me dance. Plus, you don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. I have some pride. Be seeing you. Yes, you will. Hot for teacher. Gross! Oh my god. You are out of control. <laughs> Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut up. Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring you. <laughs> Fine. Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that is a great plan. I'm coming with you. I'm scared. Let's see if I can find out where Nathan is. Move out my way, loser. Justin, it's been so long since I've seen you. Because you're way too cool for us now, Chloe. Way too much shit going on now. No need to go there now. What? <laughs> Dude, I wish. I'm working on it. I miss her. I got something for my messages? I guess not. Yo, homie, can I talk to you? Enjoy the big game, Zachary. 
I hope it's not the last. Okay, I have to bounce. Okay, homie, can't talk to you. Closer to my last resort. That's so ironic that Warren asked Max to the drive. Hey, Brooke, how are you? I'm here as usual. By the way, thanks for helping Kate down. Are you okay? Mm, sweet. I need to find Nathan. Have you seen him around? Ask Warren. I mean, you're going to the movies with him and everything. Come on, Brooke. Don't be that way. Nathan was suspended, but he should still be on campus. Warren's not good enough for you? Okay. What? I saw Nathan pissed and walking off campus earlier. Good luck getting that date, Max. I might feel better taking your drone for a quick flight. Miss Grant finally gave up and let me fly her again. But you're going to the drive-in with Warren, so you don't have time to fly my drone. Really? I can't fly your drone because I'm going to see ape movies with Warren? You You're are jealous. perceptive, Max. Now, excuse me. My drone needs me. Good. Nathan is not around. I should go back to Chloe. I had to clear away another batch of dead birds today. Coast is clear. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ah, oh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. You suck. This is like the coolest best friends ever. Everyone has a best friend like that, I do. It's so lame, they don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. What if he's in now here? I just have to find Nathan's room. What? Every room? Okay, that's not him. Okay, so if I was a dick, what would my room be? Yeah, I was, that's gotta be him. This can only be Nathan's room. to find Nathan's phone or anything with clues. Figured enough. Okay, Max, now that he's not here, I need Chloe to step up and not stop acting out so much, but that won't happen if you and you're acting mixed in illegal crap like breaking into black wall at night. I know it happened, so don't bother to try to explain. I hoped you could get, back, get her back on the right track, but it looks like she's getting stuck again. You could be such a good influence on her unless you both want to be played by but she can't be keep leaving even now. Sorry, Joyce, even if I got shit against, but I'm trying to be good even for the No, Max, I forget you're still a teenage adult. She's still so big. She's still forgiving. I don't think this prescription has helped, Nathan. Clearly. That looks like a totally fun show. Even Nathan has a light side. That must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. No, be stupid to turn it on. That is so Chloe. Oh my God, Chloe, oh, Chloe. Wow, 
Nathan clearly casts his fetish down. Yeah. I don't think one stick. book can guide the Prescotts. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. If only all your energy went into photography. It's so damn creepy, but the guy has his own style. That monochrome camera is brand new and cost about six grand. So cute and ironic. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. Oh, he said he didn't like his dad. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, the Prescotts rule. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Nathan is way into this party. Now I remember why I hate you, and why Kate will get justice. Oh man, Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. Too bad Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome, and far away. Yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. This is strong stuff. Holy shit, that's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A gift from... Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. These films all have a dark pattern. Weirdo. Nathan Prescott, all American teen. What the hell are all those marks on the floor? I think that's everything. Get out of here. Cool. Now it's open. I see Nathan next right here. Am I... Max, what are you doing? Hurry up. What am I supposed to be doing? Let's find out what you're hiding. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. Am I done? Now I have Nathan's phone, so I can show it to Chloe. Well, before Nathan comes back. Yeah, hey, I'm not skipping this. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So, what did you find? It's His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. Dang. What are you doing in my dorm? You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho. <clears throat> Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. <clears throat> you are so fucking dead. <clears throat> oh my god, Warren, you're cool. Get off me, bro. <clears throat> <clears throat> Stop the hat. Warren, stop it! Come on! Oh! Oh, my head! Why are y'all looking at me like that, huh? You! And you! You're all dead! 
Let's go. Now. Plus, my dad is on his way. You're all fucked. He owns you. Even if Nathan definitely deserved a beating, we should try to be better than that. Exactly. And that's going to conduct it at the part of Life is Strange. Thank you guys for watching. Continue the spam.